sooner wanted to say happy holidays to everybody. Tell sweet hands, oh my gosh. So today is Christmas and it's gonna be the last day of Vlogmas this year. So I just wanted to say thank you guys so much who have watched all 25 days. That's awesome, I really appreciate it. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. So today, in the last day of Vlogmas, I'm gonna be doing a what I got for Christmas haul. So hopefully you guys are interested. Um, I pretty much knew most of the things I was gonna get because I picked them out, but my mom did surprise me with two things, so I'm gonna go ahead and start with those. So the first thing is this camera case backpack. Um, I really wanted this for when I was in Japan. I had mentioned it to her like a long time ago, but I thought that she had forgotten. And if you open it, it has all of these different compartments for your camera stuff, and it actually has a tablet pocket here, so I thought this would be perfect for days when I'm going out to film. Um, I don't know if I've really mentioned this, but I am going to be doing a travel channel when I'm in Japan, so this will be able to hold all of my camera stuff, which is going to make it so easy. She also surprised me with this. Um, this is the Lights Skin and Earth album, so I love this artist so, so, so much. She's one of my favorites, and I've listened to her music since I was in junior high, I want to say, so been quite a long time since I've been listening to her music and um, I'm actually gonna try to go see her in concert very soon so I was very excited about this and it's a really interesting CD like it's just like a peach color it's not like really decorated or anything which I think is a really cool like minimal design so yeah my parents also got me a couple of things from Lush so this bag is really cute it has like the star and the moon so very up my alley um, I picked out this one when I was shopping with my mom. This is a jelly bomb. I'm not sure of the exact name, so I will put it down below. I haven't tried any of the jelly bombs yet, but I'm really excited to see what they're about. I also got a, an ectoplasm jelly bomb, a secret arts jelly bomb. Two of the Bewitched, what are these, bubble bars. So this is from the Halloween collection. Three of the Monster Monsters Ball bath bombs. These are my all-time favorite and they only come out for Halloween. So I got three of those. And I also got my two favorite, um, two of my favorite at least, shampoo and conditioner. The I Love Juicy shampoo and the Veganese conditioner. I also really like the Daddy-O shampoo for blonde hair, but this I Love Juicy is a really good um, clarifying shampoo, so really awesome. I had also been asking for a new bento box. Um, my favorite brand is Mon Bento. It's actually a French company, so I ended up getting the square one. So I also have the rectangular one, but this one is a lot bigger and holds a lot more food, so I thought that that would be really awesome. This one is just an all black box. My other one is like a lavender and then I also got a pot, it's like a, I guess it's a bento bag so you can put your um, bento box inside of it and you can carry it like that. And then I also asked for these which are two of the small sauce cups so you can put, you know, some liquid type of things in the bento without it spilling all over the place. So I'm really excited to try this out. I absolutely love bento boxes. <laughs> Another thing that I have been, um, kind of considering picking up for quite a long time is a travel wallet. So this one is from Typo. It says travel often. And this is what I plan to take with me when I am flying because it has spaces for all of the important things like your passport, boarding passes, tickets, things like that. You can even put like change in here. Um, you can also loop your pen or your keys here. So I think that this will be really useful when you're flying so you can keep all of your documents together, especially for like international travel when you need to fill out paperwork and things like that. So I cannot wait to use this. I also received a Matt and Matt coin purse. So in the States, this isn't super useful for me, but in Japan, there are a lot of coins. Um, all of their currency goes up to $5 in coins. So all of the small coins up to 500 yen 
are coins instead of bills so you will have a lot of coins so I just figured having a nice small pouch like this where I could put like my hundred and five hundred yen coins in so I could carry this around with me would be really useful instead of making my wallet super heavy with coins. <laughs> I apologize for the weird lighting I don't know what is going on but I'm still getting used to this new light that I picked up for myself for a Christmas present so the light is going in and out and it's just depending on the sun right now, I guess. So I also received this Matinat travel wallet. Um, this company, Matinat, is a vegan leather company. They also use recycled plastics in their um, wallets and bags and things like that. So I thought that that was really cool. So this one is a nice big wallet and it has a bunch of different spots. My best friend actually also got me this Target gift card. I kind of forgot about that. So this has a ton of card pockets and this is a place where you can put your pen around, then a zip pocket. This is like a passport flap over here and then more card slots there. So I will definitely not be running out of room with this anytime soon. And this feels really luxurious and very um, well made. So I cannot wait to start using this. I'm actually gonna switch this out for my previous wallet today because I can't wait to use this another day. <laughs> I also received this Low and Sons travel bag. This is called the Catalina Deluxe Small and this is the Midnight Ash color. So it's a nice like gray color. It's really beautiful. Um, I've seen this a lot online. There's like a video like how much you can fit into this weekender bag. And I thought that that was really interesting when I saw it. And it has a compartment on the bottom where you can put your shoes. So it doesn't touch any of your other things. Or you can also put like your electronics down there. It does have like a padded um, section down there so that it is well protected. And I thought that this would be awesome for short traveling such as like weekend travel or just taking like, you know, like a three day trip somewhere instead of taking a huge suitcase. If you can pack really light, you can just take one of these and you're good to go. So I cannot wait to use this as well. And then last but certainly not least, I finally got a pair of vegan Doc Martens. This will be my third pair of Doc Martens. The previous two were leather, but now that I no longer purchase or support the leather industry, I really wanted to get a vegan pair. So they literally look exactly like my other pair. So there's really no reason for me to not have a vegan version of them. So I cannot wait to wear this. The only difference that I've noticed is that this tag on the back is a tan, whereas my other ones I think were black where the tan is but really not a big deal at all and I can't wait to start breaking these in so I can get rid of my other ones. So I have been wanting these for a very, very, very long time now. So I finally got them. All right guys, so that is everything that I got for Christmas. Let me know down below what you got for Christmas or what your favorite thing is if you celebrate Christmas or let me know what holiday you celebrate in your family. So thank you guys again so, so, so much for supporting me this past year. And I think I started my channel early fall 2016 so thank you guys for all your support since then and thank you for supporting vlogmas um it wouldn't have been possible without you guys of course so thank you so much for watching this video make sure to like if you enjoyed subscribe to stick around for more videos and check out my other videos if you haven't already i'll see you guys in 2018 Bye bye